Hey everybody, Travis here. Tonight coming at you with something a little different. Coming at you with a, a full review. Gonna do a full review of a new Riot knife. And um, you know, I do so many quick views. I don't get to share my opinion too often. And I, it'll be kind of a, kind of a opening first perspective it's not a user's perspective because it's a pretty much a brand new knife that just came out. And, um, you know, I'm gonna give you my first impressions of it anyway. So a little more time here, a little more of my maybe opinion than I normally give in the quick view. So a new knife, gonna, I mean, I should have done it yesterday because I had two different versions of it. And, um, well, people wanted them and I didn't want to make them wait, so I shipped the new ones out, but let's see. Yeah, that's it. So, well, yesterday I had them both here, but new Toshi Barucha design. Baby machine. So I don't have the bead blast here anymore. But I do have the blue. Just maybe we'll we'll check it out. Won't show you the book too long. You've probably seen them in the pictures. You want to see the real deal. Blade length 3.26. That's what I'm looking at. And the weight, four ounces. Got that damn steel RWL 34 blade. So let's check it out. I don't have them both here tonight, but. We'll check out the one that I do have. So yeah, kind of an opening. It's been opened before, but what I did last night, I opened it and got the Riot Knives badge. Riot Knives cleaning cloth. Got that Riot Knives knife bag and then the baby machine Toshi Barucha design so yeah they give you the little little card little badge to have this one's 45 to 200 so it's a limited run knife the baby machine. It's a high quality card, kind of kind of looks like titanium, some type of metal card. Let me get down to the knife. I always make sure I got the extra hardware because they all should come with the extra hardware. So it's there. And yet I opened it last night, so I I touched it for a, a couple minutes. So here was my impressions, first impressions. Yeah, pretty cool. And I've had it quite a few Riot knives. Turned it over and went, I went, ha. <laughs> Made myself laugh what happened. I went to, and well, it's not a flipper knife. So I looked at it a little bit more. Um, this is what happened. And then I went to open it like this. And just didn't really have any luck at all. Realizing that, you know, I'm putting my finger on the lock bar, locking it, the detent ball right in there, and it's never going to open. So, I looked at it a little bit more. You see my hands are sweaty, so it'll come right off. Checked out the knife closed a little bit more. That blue stonewashed titanium finish. 
those satin drilled out marks there. And this four ounce knife. Then I noticed, yeah, pretty cool how it's blue down in that clip. And definitely a different shaped clip. And more. So yeah, I, I like that look. That's what I was thinking. Kind of a fake integral look. Right, that centering on the Riot is just, just perfect. So, um, I've been in the Spyderco a lot. I, I use this Spidey Flick and boom. I mean, it's, I guess it's not called the Spidey Flick or, or is it? I mean, to me it was or is or anyway. The Riot, the Tashi Flick. And um, yeah, that worked great. And I love doing that. That's what I do a lot. Well, I've had a lot of spider codes, so just kind of, I didn't know. I mean, me, I didn't know that that's what you were supposed to do with this knife is um, flick it open. I mean, I still don't know if that's what you're supposed to do with this knife. Maybe you're just supposed to drop it open. I don't really, I never asked anybody. Just got the knife, opened it up. I opened it up with this knife right here, actually. And possibly when I opened it, I went and then, or I could have just flipped it open, I'm not sure. But so many times I do that, and you know, I've been into spider codes a lot if you know me, and this is just my personal opinion channel. Finally doing a full review to give my opinion a little more. I love the spider co hole, I do. Just gives you so many options on how to open a knife. Um, so a, a lot of times in my military, um, any spider co knife pretty much I tend to I tend to do this with my militaries my Mannixes or whichever spider co I have and that's it was just a dream actually to just and <laughs> that really feels good how, how smooth it is um, and the detent is just enough to where that it just just launches out of there. You can hear it, I think. So yeah, you'll be a little careful on the closing, I think. Kind of hits my hits my thumbnail right there, but it's super smooth. And when you when you disengage that lock bar, which does have the hidden steel lock bar interface there. It's a nice lock up too. And when you disengage that, and then the blade's coming down. And um, just very smooth. So it rides on ceramic ball bearings. It's like almost all the Riots, um, especially nowadays. Titanium pivot. Titanium clip, titanium screws on there as well. So yeah, I mean, I just checked it once again to make sure you really can't open it with your thumb. But I, I, I guess it's made to just flick it open and awesome really really smooth solid those were my first impressions let's get a little more of a 
Just a close up look at this thing. You can see that stone washed flat here on the blade. That satin grind. There on this wedge as well, satin. You got that stone wash back. Even the even the spine coming down the tip is stone washed right there on the back. Of course, this one that damage steel RWL thirty four. It's just a great overall steel, sharpening wise and and edge retention wise. See that maker's mark right there. On the back side of the blade. Check out those blue, blue dots. You see, three. Seven. Yeah, I know they got seven on there for whatever reason. But yeah, like that shape. Let's just check it out in hand. Not left handed, so <laughs> that feels crazy. Oh, yeah, it does feel pretty good. Feels much better in my right hand. Ha! <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure if you're left handed, it would. Probably feel just as good, um, but I, I can't say. It doesn't feel that great in my left hand. Well, hey, thanks for joining me. I'm gonna try to do some more, some more of these uh, full reviews, especially of some of the new riots that are out. Possibly, possibly, maybe do one of the. The Valhalla. Maybe I'll do one new torrents. Quite a few of those out. So, yeah, these new knives just came out. Thanks for joining me. And if you like what you see, hit the subscribe button. We'll see you next time. Have a good one.